What's going on guys? In today's video, we're gonna go over the top ways to improve your cybersecurity skills in 2023. For those of you that don't already subscribe, my name is Cyber Tom. My channel is all about IT and cybersecurity education. If you're interested in this kind of content or you're interested in pursuing this field, then hit the subscribe button down below and come join us for all things cybersecurity. So getting right into it, the first thing that I'm gonna mention that you can do to improve your skill set in 2023 in cybersecurity is gonna be something that's pretty pretty basic and you should be doing every single day and that's going to be being aware of the latest cybersecurity news. Now there are multiple ways that you can get this done. You can be on LinkedIn every day, you can be on Facebook, um, easily joining groups that are all about cybersecurity that are giving you the latest news. I have two websites that I think are the best in my opinion. One of them is going to be one that is my second favorite. The other is my first favorite. So my first favorite is definitely going to have to be the bleeping computer. I've been using this since I got into the field. It's always kept me up to date on the latest threats and the latest trends in the hacker community and world. It's also shown me a lot of threats that I've been able to apply to real life application in my positions to secure my network infrastructure better. The second one is gonna be the Hacker News. The Hacker News is a great website for giving you all of the attacks that are going on around the world and sometimes also how you can mitigate them if there is a mitigation if it's not a zero day threat. This is something that you're gonna be asked in interviews. They're gonna ask you, what are you doing to stay on top of your cybersecurity news? Every interview that I've ever been in for cybersecurity, it's been a question. So if you're coming into this field, be prepared. Don't be left with no answer when they ask you this question because it's gonna look very bad on your part that you're not really involved in knowing what's going on. How are you gonna protect their infrastructure if you are not even keeping up to date with the news? So that's number one, stay on top of your news, guys. Please, 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 I'm telling you, it's only gonna help. The next thing I got for you here is gonna be something that I've been using frequently, and that's gonna be Hack the Box Academy. This is gonna be great for somebody who is new to penetration testing and hacking. It's gonna teach you the steps you need to take to get into the full realm of hack the box online and this is also going to give you a great chance to do other things defensively not just offensively anymore to improve your skill set in cybersecurity. so let's take a look at it real quick so i spun up a new account for you here just so you can see exactly what it's going to look like they're going to give you free cubes right here these cubes are what's going to enable you to take some of these modules now in the modules is where you're gonna have all of your learning paths here. You have injection attacks, white box attacks, Windows event logs. Like I said, this is not just offensive anymore, it's defensive as well. Um, this is a great opportunity to learn some of the fundamentals that you're gonna need for penetration testing and or defensive learning. And real quickly, you also have skilled paths here. You can go through, hit the basic tool set, which is gonna give you the basic knowledge of everything. And look, here you go, 470 projected cubes. Now, obviously you're gonna run out eventually. You're gonna to wanna to get into a subscription plan or just buy some cubes. And you could do that right up here in the top right section. I think it is a pretty good price point for a lot of these cubes. You can see here, if you're a student, for $8 a month, you get access to all modules. Uh, if you're not a student, $18 a month, and you get access to 200 cubes each month, which is more than enough for the average person. So back real quick, here are the skill paths, cracking into Hack the Box. This is gonna teach you exactly how to get prepared for Hack the Box. You can also go here to the job roles, 
and the job roles are going to give you some of the roles that maybe you're interested in and how to become the best in that role. So the next way to improve your skill set is going to be something that I've been introduced from, from Simply Learn, and that is going to be their postgraduate program. This is going to give you a chance to apply real world application to your skill set. How it's going to do that is they're working with companies like MIT and EC Council. These are two huge names in the industry. EC Council is the one that offers the CEH certification, which is the Certified Ethical Hacker. So these are huge companies here that are bringing you this knowledge and these modules so you know you're getting the most up to date knowledge when you take this graduate program. What's cool about this program, it's not too long. It's six months long and you can complete it at your own pace. Now the classes that you're gonna be taking with this program are secure system design, application design, network design, which if you have watched any of my videos, you know that that is a great thing to learn for a beginner. You need to learn the playing field before you learn how to protect it. You'll also learn penetration testing. You'll learn security policies and how to manage the security posture of an organization. So a big question for a lot of people, right, is gonna be the obvious. How, how can we pay for this, right? So there is an option to pay in full for it, uh, which if you have it, good for you. Get it done, right? Now, for most people, that's not gonna be an option. What they allow is some installments so that you'll be able to pay in increments and not be such a burden to your budget. Um, this is gonna be an awesome opportunity for you to elevate yourself after you graduate or maybe you just wanna get it done while you're in school, another great opportunity. So if you're interested in Simply Learn's postgraduate program, then I will drop the link down in the description and show you exactly how to get there and get yourself registered. I'll also drop the links down below to show you the security news sites that I think are important that we talked about, as well as the Hack the Box Academy. This last one may be something that you really haven't considered, but I think it's very important for you to get you to. You're going to be doing what when you're done with all these skills? You're going to be interviewing. So what you need to prepare yourself for is the day that you get the call for an interview. And how you're going to do that and how I did it was go online, do quick Google searches and search what is the most relevant IT cybersecurity questions that are being asked in interviews even Reddit um, and other forums like this are gonna show you some threads of people's experiences and how they were interviewed and the questions that were prevented. Glassdoor is another option. Go through that, pull up some of these questions. If you start to see a reoccurring theme, which you will, jot them down and start to document and kind of rehearse how you're gonna answer questions like that. Because a lot of us, right, we get stumped. It's not that you don't know the answer to these questions. It's more so that you weren't prepared. And when you feel unprepared or on the spot, it's very hard to answer the question correctly. So that's going to be my last recommendation for the video. Make sure that you are preparing for your interviews. That's all I got for this video, guys. I hope that you love the video and I love receiving all of the comments that I've been receiving lately. I am going to start stitching some of these comments and posting them on shorts so that I can answer your question in a more formal fashion. Also, if you go over to my about section on my YouTube now, you'll see down in the links that I have a career coaching link. This is gonna be a great opportunity for those that wanna speak with me one-on-one. -on -one. You can schedule time on my calendar and give you some one-on-one -on -one time where we can go through your struggles and how we can improve or get you that job that you're looking for. And I will do my best to help you, obviously. Uh, so check that out. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. And I'll catch you in the next video.